this everything? Looks like it. Great work, Gohan. I really appreciate it. All that's left is to build the chip. Uh, uh, hey, what's with that look? Uh, are you really Gohan? I am. Honest. Uh, it's a long story. I'll bet. I mean, look at you. <sighs> well, you are your father's son, and Saiyans are weird, so I guess this isn't out of the question. No use applying logic to you guys, anyway. She's being surprisingly calm about all this. I guess living with Vegeta's kind of numbed her. Thanks for being my delivery boy. You're the best. Uh, you're welcome. And sorry I surprised you. By the way, now that you're here, do you want to watch me fix the android up? I'm pretty sure he's safe, but, you know, you can't be too careful. So do you mind staying for a bit? Oh, uh, no problem. Oh, this is an android. These things were built to kill Dad. There we go. It's done? Mm-hmm, almost. The chip you helped us build was successfully integrated. It may be tiny, but it's what gives the android life. Now, we stick it in the cranial chamber here, and... <laughs> Voila! Mm. Analyzing situation. He's online. Hey, you! Got a name? I am Android 16. Scanning memory logs. I was brought here by Krillin for repairs. His memory circuits are functional. Oh, good. He's back! You did it, guys! Are you the ones who repaired me? I am grateful. Oh, no need to mention it. If you want to thank someone, thank Gohan here. After all, he helped us fix you. Gohan. H hello Searching. Data profile found. Go on, son of Goku. Hey now, mister. Just because he's Goku's son doesn't mean you have to terminate him. He is irrelevant. My target is Goku, not his offspring. That's so. Okay, I guess I can live with that. Hmm. He's staring at me. Why? Doctor. Yes? I wish to run a field test in the nearby forest to gauge this body's functionality. Hmm. Well, I don't see a problem with that. Come with me, Gohan. Your assistance may be required. Really? Um, okay. Sorry, kid, but humor him. He should be all right. But we just restarted his systems, and you never know what could happen. Sh sure thing. I will go on ahead. Find me in the forest. Counting on you, Junior. R right. You guys must be really popular here. How's that body of yours? Hmm. Satisfactory. Diagnostics indicate 100% functionality. I'm glad to hear that. Um. Uh. Oh. <laughs> so, do you like animals? Affirmative. They put me at ease. I like animals too. All sorts of things interest me, actually. I'm hoping to be a scholar someday. A fine goal. I am certain you will make an exemplary scholar. By the way, are you really out to kill my dad? Affirmative. That is my only directive. I have no other use. As a result, I was declared defective and stored away. Huh? I loathe conflict. Therefore, as a weapon, I am defective. That's no reason to shut you down. Dr. Giraud once said, He made me in the image of his deceased son. But he was bold and daring. I am not. A war machine that shuns war is nothing but a failure. D don't say that. It's the truth. Ha <laughs> ha! So this is where all the cuddly critters been hiding. H who are you people? The uh, judge folks. Looking to make a gosh darn fortune off of pelts. What? <laughs> Looks like we hit the jackpot. Can't believe we fight all these birds in one spot. They're poachers. Go on. Way ahead of you. Let's send these jerks packing. I bet this is really good.
Cops are crazier than a dog in a hubcap factory! Threat neutralized. Yeah. Go on. I am grateful for your assistance in protecting the animals. As well as for assisting with my repairs. My apologies for not thanking you sooner. Oh, it's no big deal. Hmm. The real reason I asked you to accompany me is a discrepancy between my data and your current appearance. I intended to personally reevaluate your potential in combat, but thanks to the altercation with the poachers, there is no longer such a need. Your power is immense. It far surpasses all your records in my system. I foresee you becoming the deciding factor in the outcome of the Cell Games. Me? But my dad's way stronger. <laughs> we are not so different, you and I. We aren't? Let us return for now. The doctor will be worried if we take too long. Right. Let's head back. How are Sixteen and I alike? How'd it go? Exceptional. I am fully operational thanks to you. Nice job out there, boys. I heard you rounded up some poachers. Bet you socked him something fierce, huh? It's like morons going up against the son of Goku and a giant android. Ha! It was nothing, really. <clears throat> I know! Why don't you stay for dinner? It's the least I can do to repay you for your help today. Honestly, I haven't done anything. Oh, don't be silly. Make yourself at home and spend the night while you're at it. I'll phone your mother for you, okay? Okay, sure. Oh! So, Gohan's at Bulma's? I was wondering where he'd run off to. Yep, she just called and said he's staying tonight, too. Her family's loaded. Gohan's probably having the feast of his life right now. Aren't you jealous, Goku? Well, sure. I love myself some good grub. But nothing beats your home-cooked meals. And if we're being honest, I'd choose them over any spread in the world. Really? Thanks. Even if it's just flattery. Uh, oh, I'm getting so embarrassed. 